and that's terrifying as a parent to hear. A drug Madison Murphy's son uses might be on life support. Murphy's four-year-old son, Cole, has a form of leukemia. He gets his treatments at Children's Hospital. We know that we're in really good hands. Cole uses a drug called vincristine, commonly used in chemotherapy. But recently, hospitals have been dealing with a shortage of that drug. One of the uh, medicines, uh, or companies that was making the medicine actually stopped making it. So a little bit later, um, now we are dealing with a problem in the last remaining manufacturing company that had a production problem. Children's Dr. Matthew Cutney says they were first told they wouldn't get more until December. Immediately, um, we started evaluating our current stock uh, of medicine that we had, and we looked very carefully at how much of the medicine we were giving on a weekly basis to all of our children. I don't think doctors should be put in that position. Like, they're going through enough, the kids are going through enough, parents are going through enough. Good news for children. Dr. Cutney tells us they may be getting more medicine as soon as the end of this month. Doctors and parents agree advocacy helped get more of the cancer-fighting meds back in stock. So the only thing we can do is just advocate it and share it and spread it the best that we can. To make sure all kids get what they need to get better. In Birmingham, Mary O'Connell, WVTM 13.